I saw time in the hallway. He was shrouded in the grief version of an old friend that I hadn't seen in a while. And when he smiled at me, I wondered about his wrinkles, which made me reach for my face and touch my wrinkles, which led me to the gray, my gray, and make me wonder where all the years went. Then I had age too. And then I thought of the hole, the hole through which all those years fell. Was that same hole through which the children crept up, through which the profession blossomed? Is the hole that we dance through and we laugh through and we cry through? I saw time in the hallway. He said I should have said sorry. Sorry for breaking her heart. Sorry for walking away. Sorry for killing his dreams. Sorry for not being there. Sorry for not living. This life that is so short and precious. Sorry that we bury our dreams so deep that when we go to find them, what we dig up is just despair. I saw time in the hallway and he gave me a rose and said, you should have told her you loved her and carried her into the future of love and ecstasy and unknown potential. You should have told her you loved her and kissed her and caressed her. I saw time in the hallway and he said the grapes are overgrown with weeds. That when bones are buried six feet deep, the past never creeps up again. And that though we miss him so much, it's over. And all we have are the memories that are so deep that they cut us and cut us so deep that it doesn't even bleed anymore because there's no blood that deep. I saw time in the hallway. He showed me my cup. I said it was half empty. He said, it's half full. I said, it's too late. He said, it just started. I looked to yesterday. He said, what about tomorrow? I said, I can't do it. He said, get off your butt. I said, I'm too old. He said, you're too young. I said, I let time pass away. He said, here I am. Take me. I saw time in the hallway and he said, seize the moment.